As the years go by, we grow and we change. Our wants and desires from 10 years ago may be vastly different than where they are today. It really is inevitable. Life happens, priorities change, and as we gain insight and knowledge, our worldview changes as well. Unfortunately, sometimes our growth can negatively impact relationships in our lives, especially romantic relationships. The guy or girl that you were at 25 is not the same person you are at 35. You basically outgrow people in your life including romantic partners. If you're watching this video, you may be thinking that you may have outgrown your own partner, but are looking for some definitive signs. So here are the six signs that you may have outgrown your relationship. Sign number one, your priorities are different. She's an ambitious, career-focused money saver, while he prefers to focus on his hobbies and spend money like there is a never-ending pot of it. He is also bouncing from job to job. While once in the same page, one person has grown and become focused, while the other partner has become stagnant. Sign number two, your interests are different. He is a political junkie and a huge Star Wars fan, while she's into reality TV and fashion. He wants to talk about the upcoming election, and she's not even a registered voter. There is a problem here. At some point, these two people became polar opposites and started to lack commonality. One is interested in world events while the other is more interested in looking cute and taking selfies. Sign number three, nothing to talk about. You know that you have outgrown each other when you really have nothing to talk about or it's the same old stories over and over. It is important to recognize that you have nothing to talk about because you have nothing in common and you have nothing in common because you have outgrown each other. Sign number four, you're bored. If you find your partner boring, you have outgrown them. The truth is that you find them boring because you now share different interests, are on a different intellectual level, and have no commonality. Sign number five, different values. Once upon a time, you were both drinkers and into going out a lot. Now she's a homebody, but he still likes to drink and go out a lot. She also likes to attend church, but he's a non-believer. Lifestyle and differing religious beliefs are big changes that can happen as we grow and mature. Sign number six, different goals. His goal is to have a nice family life with a few kids, while her goal is to retire by 50 and then travel the world. She doesn't see kids in her future and views him as a burden while he sees children as a blessing. It is hard to admit to yourself that you have outgrown your relationship without sounding like you are criticizing your partner or being judgy, but it is what it is. You should not feel guilty because you have grown and changed, especially if your growth has been for the better. So what are your thoughts on outgrowing relationships? Do you agree with my signs? When you outgrow a relationship, do you stick it out or do you try and move on? Please share your thoughts and comments. Leave me a comment below, give me a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe.